Hey everybody, I got a story here from ancientorigins.net for you. Now I have talked a lot of my videos how tomb robbing was a bad problem in the ancient past and it is still going on today. We think we know a lot about ancient Egypt but there is so much history that we have lost due to this problem that happened a long long time ago and that is still going on today and this article from Ancient Origin kind of brings that to light. It says, ancient Egyptian mummies found floating in sewage water in Egypt. Several mummies complete with sarcophagi were retrieved from the dirty water where they had been found floating near Elmina, Egypt. According to a statement from the Egyptian Ministry of Antiquities, two previously unknown Greco-Roman era mummies were located this week. They had been buried in tombs in a small village in northeastern Egypt about 240 kilometers or 150 miles south of Cairo. However, police were alerted to the, sarcoph the sarcophagi when they were found floating in polluted sewage water. The centuries-old sarcophagi held mummies which were wrapped in many layers of thick linen. Very few human remains were recovered from the wrappings. The wooden sarcophagi containing the mummies had suffered extensive damage due to the foul water. It is reported by the Daily News Egypt that they, may, that they have since disintegrated. The artifacts dated back to the Greco-Roman era of Egyptian history from 332 BC to 395 AD. The remains were preserved in the tradition of the time with colorful drawings of women on the sarcophagi tops. This type of mummy portrait, known as the Fayum portraits, often depicted the head and the chest of the deceased painted onto the panel using wax or egg tempera paint techniques. Colorful designs decorated the sarcophagi but they had no ancient Egyptian writings or hieroglyphs. It is not clear how or why the mummies were left in the sewage water, but experts at the ministry suspect the artifacts might have been deliberately discarded there during illegal excavations. Rather than be found with priceless antiquities, any diggers, looters, or smugglers might have dumped the mummies so as not to suffer the penalties of the country's severe security restrictions. Says so the head of antiquities at the ministry said, the robbers may have resorted to dumping these sarcophagi in the irrigation canal when they felt that authorities were closing in on them, or perhaps when they were approaching a security checkpoints. It says looting and illegal excavation of historical sites is a problem around the world, and political turmoil doesn't make the situation easier for officials. According to experts, Looters will strip Egypt of most of its archaeological heritage within the next 25 years unless something is done to stop it. A satellite survey project funded by the National Geographic Society has examined more than 4,000 archaeological sites in Egypt using Google Earth satellite imagery, and already tens of thousands of looting pits have been identified across the landscape. So I will just leave the link for this article, and uh, here is what these sarcophagi look like and this is just a very unfortunate problem and you know I'm not sure what the solution to this is but it's a very bad problem as far as losing history to greed and uh, the quest for money so I just thought this was interesting thought I would share it have a nice day